Beat Charcot Marie Tooth Disease, or CMT, is named after the three doctors from England and France who first described it more than 100 years ago. It's a genetic condition that causes problems with sensory and motor nerves, and for some, the progression is so severe they become wheelchair bound. But there is new treatment that may halt CMT in its tracks. See how much you can lift up your foot. 21 year old Dakota Riley has had problems with her feet for almost half her life. I couldn't run anymore, and I did have difficulty walking, but I had the mentality of I'm just going to do whatever I can until I physically can't do it anymore. Dakota was diagnosed with Charcot tooth disease, a condition that often leads to weakened muscles on the bottom of the feet. When they're walking, their foot is hanging down and, and they're unable to, to lift it. As Dakota's condition worsened, four surgeries over eight months allowed her to walk without braces and start college at the New York Fashion Institute of Technology. I'm so proud of her. She's, um, she's thriving and she's doing extremely well. I mean, she has so much struggle every day and she's just, she just keeps going. Karen Riley serves on the board of the Hereditary Neuropathy Foundation and is closely following testing of a new drug for CMT known as PXT3003. If approved by the FDA, it's said to stop the progression and possibly give back a small percentage of what was lost in terms of muscle wasteness. PXT3003 is a combination of three drugs that are already approved for unrelated conditions. In earlier trials, patients showed significant improvement. Dakota was not in the trial because she has a less common form of CMT, but Karen says she hopes her daughter will benefit from the drug once it's approved. It would change her life. That drug is in phase three clinical trials right now, which is the last stage before the FDA considers it for approval.